Hello. What day is it? Your birthday. It's my what? Birthday. Today I am 21. It is November 13th. Not typically 21 yet because I was born at 4 o'clock. But uh, Connor keeps saying I'm just 21. But not 21 until 4 because I think I was born at 4. I can't remember. My mom used to tell me all the time. I can't remember now. like what I'm doing he's like always like always there right do you know that it's mama's birthday <laughs> give you a little sneak peek of the birthday outfit um i need to find my heels though here they are um i think i'm gonna go with black heels with a black like coat um like dressy coat okay let's show the outfit here is my birthday outfit i'm gonna turn on the other one too i got this little top from forever 21 which you're not supposed to be seeing it because it's gonna be my Forever 21 closing sale haul. But sneak peek. Then my baby looks sexy and he's blue on blue. Mm. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so I'm wearing this top of Forever 21, my American, uh, par uh, American apparel, American Eagle jeans, and my boots that are actually from Walmart. And everybody thinks that they're from like Aldo or something. But they're from Walmart. <laughs> And uh, yeah, okay, I'm back. Ooh, that dark old back. So we are going out for dinner right now. My grandma makes me cake every year. It's a tradition now, so I make time for that. Every single year, she makes my favorite cake. It's Chilean cake. It's called Torta Miloja. It drives me crazy. But this year, I found she made it a couple years. She made it for my grandpa's birthday. She made the Torta Amor, which is the same cake, but with strawberry jam and cream. And I fall in love with it, so she changed my cake from my traditional torta miloja to torta amor. So I'm really excited for that. That's a tradition. So we're going out to dinner uh, later. Um, that's what I do every year. I always make sure I make time to go see the cake that she made me. And uh, right now we're just going to go get breakfast. Yeah. Or I guess brunch. Yeah, brunch. We're supposed to be breakfast, but yeah, started doing stuff. So yeah, brunch. And then uh, we're just gonna go with the flow, you know? boyfriend went to go pay and he's like oh he's like it's my girlfriend's birthday can i get like a free dessert for her and the girl's like well you have to sign up to the bp app put your birthday in blah 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 blah, blah. 
And Connor's like, no, you're not doing that. Like, no. I was like, we need to show you her ID because I'm not signing up to an app where they're gonna send me emails and notifications so I can show you her ID and then that's, we can call it a day. And she's like, no, we don't do it that way. So I was like, okay, well, I don't fucking tip that way then, so I give her nothing. Yeah, he tipped zero. So then I was like on her side at first. I was like, Connor, maybe it's a new thing. Like she can't control it, blah, blah, blah. But then she comes back and then she tries, she keeps going and then she's like, it's just the way we've always done things. Then that's when I looked at Connor. I was like, okay, now she's just lying and probably being lazy because I've literally gone to VPs every year for my birthday and I've always gone to free dessert, no problem. I've Every never year. had to like sign up an app, an app for where my they dessert. Send you promos. I'm not getting email promos for the free dessert. Like, this was like, I'm not tipping her, and he's like, he just did not tip her at all. So she lost. Between a zero percent tip or a one percent tip. Yeah, so she got zero. <laughs> yeah, so that was my birthday experience. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Now, the money that we were gonna give her for a tip is now gonna go towards your own personal dessert. So that's where we're headed right now. Where are we going? Costco. <laughs> <laughs> You're not doing it for me. You've been talking about this cheesecake all day. Yeah. And cheese. You're doing it for you. <laughs> oh my god, it's bright. Oh, it's you so clean bright. Your camera with the thing. No, it's not dirty. It's just so much exposure. Cheers. So we went to Canadian Tire, and Connor, his girl was like handing out some like little ticket things, and they were giving out free gifts. I knew it wasn't gonna be much because it never is. Connor just wants thought that maybe we would be getting like a free car or something, <laughs> and like made me go to get that free gift. So when we went over there, this girl um, was actually trying to introduce this deal on this hair straightener. So I had to sit there for a bit and watch her do a demo. Just so I can tell her that I'm not gonna be getting the straightener, um, but we did get something for free, and I think she gave one for Con gave one to Connor because yeah. Connor was so hyped about getting a free <laughs> gift. It's just a lens cleaner. So, I mean, not completely mad at it. Now we're gonna go to Winners and Marshalls. I just want to look around. I like looking at like quality stuff because sometimes I like DIYing certain things. Yeah. And then we should probably start heading over to my grandparents after pick up Leia and head over. You don't understand how you're doing that right now. Do it. I, I don't even think like you should be doing this right here right now. <laughs> I haven't seen you without glasses in like two weeks. Are you gonna cry? Oh my god, I've been blind for like the last like two weeks. Aww, yeah, see. Look at where he put his contact. <laughs> you can good. see better now? I can actually see. Good. <laughs> wow. That's Mark because I wanted to get Leia a little dress and I found this. And it's so freaking cute. Little dress. Oh my god, I can't wait to put it on her when we get home. Okay, so I went to PetSmart and I showed you guys. I got her the cute little pink dress. Because we're going to dinner at my grandparents. And then I was just like really curious if they still had the bows. Because at PetSmart, when you take your dog to put, uh, to get groomed and like bath bathed and like all that stuff, um, bathe? Bathe. Bathe. Um, they will put bows on their ear. And I used to do this when I had my dash hound. Um, she was with my parents. I remember we used to take her to the groomers and they would always put these little red bows on her ears. <laughs> and we stopped getting them after a while because she just, she print, like print, her name's Princess. She's she just- She's not bathing. <laughs> <laughs> she's not bathing, that's one thing. But she's also the kind of dog that just doesn't like to be done up. Like Leia, I've kind of gotten her used to wearing clothes, so she's like fine with it. But, but I went in and I'm like, by any chance, I'm like, you guys don't still put the little bows on the doggy's ears, do you? And she's like, yeah. And I'm like, do you mind if I steal two from you? And then she's like, no, not at all. And then I was like, yeah, I was like, sorry. I was like, it's my birthday. And like, I'm trying to get my dog ready for dinner, uh, dinner plans tonight and stuff. And she's like, oh my God. And then she's like, Oh, she's like, well, I have some really pretty sparkly ones in the back. And I was like, oh, sure. And she's like, yeah. She's like, let's give her one of those instead. And I was like, yeah, let's do that. So they gave me two little sparkly pink and red bows. <laughs> she's getting spoiled. I haven't got anything. And she's getting a new dress, new bows, a whole new look. Okay, I'm going to put Leia in her little. This is your new little dress. Come here. Oh, hello. Okay, you ready? Ready? Put your head through. Oh, you look so cute, Gushy yeah. Daddy. Oh, so pretty. So, oh, so pretty. She looks so cute. I've read them all. Step forward if you're hearing a name called. Does she look Pollard, cute? Guthrie, Aww. Coulson, <laughs> Dowler.
This is my cake that I was talking about with red jam, manghar. Coffee. But yeah, looks good. And then I didn't show Leia. But your bows didn't fit. They keep coming off and they squish your ears. But she doesn't care about me right now. That is a really good cake. I like this one. Oh, I like more than uh, Miloja. Yeah. Mm. Oh, yeah. No way. <laughs> That's a damn good cake. Who <laughs> <laughs> no. make it? I don't know if you know this about me, but I've had a lot of cake. <laughs> and this is top three cakes in the rack. That's a really good cake. <laughs> I bake you one. No, but it wasn't like this. Two I knew you were gonna like it. I like it. Oh, I he love loves it. it. <laughs> Cindy one one with chocolate and and apricot jam. Oh. Newspaper is from 21 years from today. This is from November 13, 1998, on the day I was born here in Edmonton. And my grandma saved it all this time. Here's the sports for it. Connor's just going crazy right now. <laughs> and just like that, my birthday is over and I am now 21. It is 12:26. I my birthday's been done for like half an hour now. <laughs> I wanna I wanna put you on camera so bad right now. You're so lucky I'm not, but I will paint the picture for you. Connor's on the toilet while Leia sits at his feet. <laughs> and just, they both have the same look in their eyes. I want to thank everybody personally um, who wished me a happy birthday. It meant a lot to me. Today was one of the hardest birthdays I've had. <laughs> and to have people who don't know me, who... <laughs> Well, they know me, but on social media, um, wish me happy birthday, meant a lot. Very hard day, <laughs> but a very good day. And it just meant a lot to have you guys um, wish me a happy birthday on my posts. Um, it really put a smile on my face and made the situation a lot better. Since I moved out in January, things have been very rough and rocky. And I've done my best to be positive and positive online, but obviously your feelings catch up with you and it's hard. But I am now 21 and in the last year it's been, I've been very up and down. It's been a very rocky road, but here I am starting to accomplish the things I want to accomplish and I'm so happy about that. I had a, I was surrounded with people who loved me and that's all that matters. Um, my grandparents, bless them, <laughs> because they've always been there when I need them. <sighs> God, this is a lot harder than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> oh, God. Um, but yeah, I celebrated the day with people who love me, and, uh, it's all that matters. And I'm... <sighs> So glad. Today I filmed a get ready with me. I'm so sorry Chris is in the room locked and he's just not happy about it. But um, I filmed a get ready with me on my birthday. So you guys will be able to see that. It will be up. I don't know when because I have to still edit that and edit this. But it will be up sometime next week. <laughs> will it go up before this vlog or the same time as this vlog? I don't know. We will see. Ooh, I look tired. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching and till next time. Bye.